riding waves of controversies right up to the red carpet, the 2019 Oscars surprisingly went off without a host. I, I mean Hitch. Here's our five favorites from the 2019 Oscars. It's like you see these commercials and they're like, oh, it's Hollywood's biggest night. And I'm always like, whatever, shut up. Number five, Oscars ain't afraid of no host. Nobody knew how the show would go on, but this year proved that the Oscars will survive with a helping hand from the three-headed non-host hosting skills of old pals Maya Rudolph, Tina Fey, and Amy Poehler. We are not your hosts, but we're going to stand here a little too long so that the people who get USA Today tomorrow will think that we hosted. <laughs> Number four, we're not worthy of this Wayne's World reunion. Bohemian Rhapsody won four Oscars, including Best Actor for Rami Malek. I may not have been the obvious choice, but I guess it worked out. But we headbanged the hardest when Mike Myers and Dana Carvey reunited to introduce the film named after the song that made both movies rock. We're not worthy! I think I'm gonna hurl! Number three. Olivia Coleman is literally our favorite. Whether you spell it with or without the U, Coleman was one of our favorite parts of Oscars 2019 when she shocked us and herself by winning Best Actress over odds on favorite Glenn Close. You've been my idol for so long, and this is not how I, I wanted it to be, and I, I think you're amazing. I love you very much. Number two, no categories left behind. Time and again, Oscar presenters and winners reminded the Academy that cutting categories from the broadcast will not be tolerated. It is a true honor for me to present this next award live on camera, not during the commercial break. Thank you, Academy. If you think of shooting a movie and making a movie as the same thing, you've overlooked one of the most important elements of filmmaking, the editing. And we won't be doing awards during the commercials, but we will be presenting commercials during the awards. <laughs> And number one, Oscars 2019 was all about weird and awesome pairings. We want to thank the 91st Academy Awards for showing us the buddy comedies we never knew we wanted, like Helen Mirren and Jason Momoa, Brian Tyree Henry, Melissa McCarthy, and a bunny puppet. And of course, Barbara Streisand and her new favorite movie, Black Klansman? So I had to tweet about it, you know, about how good it was. For more interviews with the winners and nominees, plus coverage from the IMDb Live at the Elton John AIDS Foundation Academy Awards viewing party, stay tuned to imdb.com slash Oscars.